100 jams where hit music lives. Locked in the midday chop up right here with your girl, Evan Green, Queen Nige, your little Dirk in the mix with Lie to Me. Right about now, it's all about Chat Trap talking about what's happening in the media today. So, you know, Chat Trap is brought to you by the Village Drug and Beauty Supply and Village Auto Parts. There's only one place you need to shop for your hair, skin, baby items, grocery, and the household. It's at the Village Drug and Beauty Supply store located at number 57 Alexandria Boulevard, Nassau Village. You can get 20% off the premium now only at the Village Drugs and Beauty Supply Store. Call them at 393-3419 or WhatsApp at 441-3943. So right now, let's hop into what's happening today. And oh my gosh, the news is just crazy as to what's going on. So let's talk about it. We are all probably going through a difficult time right now. I'm sure we all are. But life is definitely not getting any easier for R. Kelly. As you know, R. Kelly is already waiting trial in several states. And now he has new accusations against him. And the shocking new allegations state that R. Kelly was involved with two underage boys that he met at McDonald's. And he's also facing accusations of bribery in which he paid an employee of the state money to create a fake ID for Aaliyah in 1994, which was to allow him to marry her when she was only 15 years old. So R. Kelly, they're saying with the two incidents with the young boys that he had met a 17-year-old boy in 2006 at McDonald's and he offered to assist with his music aspirations while in the studio R. Kelly allegedly asked the teen what he was willing to do in order to make it in the music industry and this is when him and the young boy had sexual contact. Now it was also stated that R. Kelly met a close male friend of the teen boy and the close male friend was about 16 or 17 years old and it's alleged that he also had a sexual relationship with him. Honestly, it's just like, what is going on in the world today? Uh, 2021 cannot get any more messier. And there's one divorce in Hollywood that's happening right now that I'm sure made a lot of men second-guess marriage. And honestly, at this point, this doesn't make me second-guess marriage. But Dr. Dre and his estranged wife, Nicole Young, has been going back and forth for months now, seeing this when she filed for divorce sometime back in 2020. And at this point, I'm wondering how much money does Dr. Dre truly have? Because he was just ordered to temporarily pay his estranged wife, Nicole Young, almost $3.5 million a year in spousal support, which breaks down to almost $300,000 a month. So to be exact, he's paying $293,306 per month to his ex, which is due on the first of every month until they can negotiate the terms of their final divorce settlement. Now, the payments are ordered to continue until she remarries or enters into a new relationship or the death of either party. So Dr. Dre is also ordered to cover her health insurance and to continue paying the expenses for the Ma for their Malibu home and their Pacific Palisades home as well. Now, this is just ridiculous. I mean, I, I, I really don't know how these things always play out. But in some cases, yeah, the women do definitely win. And right now, I think Nicole Young is winning big. And it's just it's, it's just crazy how much money that he has to dish out. Like I said, I know this have a lot of people second guessing marriage or definitely wanting to get a prenup and just stick to it. And so Young Blue decided to take the social media to share his thoughts of, you know, when being faithful in a relationship and at least how to continue being faithful. So basically, he's just saying, if you want to be faithful, stay off of social media. Social media is very tempting. You see all kind of different women around the world. And your woman might not exactly look like that. Either she might not have the body, she might not have the hair, just different things. So he's saying that, my black man, if you want to be faithful, just stay off of social media. Do you agree? Do you agree? I'm just saying, every female you see, you really have that much interest that you have to react. It's like you can see an attractive person, but I don't really think it matters. So I'd say I don't necessarily agree with it. But he's saying to post and just get off as soon as you can. But that's um, just a little bit of advice right there from Young Blue. And that's it for Chat Trap, talking about what's happening in the media today. Reminding you that Chat Trap is brought to you by the Village Drug and Beauty Supply and Village Auto Parts. Have no fear, the Village Auto Parts is here. They have coaster bus parts, clutch disc, starters, alternators, tail lamps, brake rotors, American and Japanese vehicle parts. The Village Hardware Store, located Alexandria Boulevard, Nassau Village. You can call them today and 
can help them find that part for you. That's 601-4746-601-4752 or WhatsApp at 525-9159. Jumping back into the mix right now, Wale, Chris Brown with Angles.